Hello and welcome back. We are back at it again in uh, some more minish half. Oh no, I didn't mean to jump down there. I meant to just adjust my uh, spring. Uh, in the last episode, what do we do? Oh, we got to like most of just hitting A. We got through most of the area. Wow. My timing. There we go. Got through most of the area. So make sure to like and subscribe. And we'll, uh, hopefully not continue to mistime all our jumps. Darn it. I knew that would happen as soon as I said it. You are not automatically taking the wings out that time. Oh, but a keystone. Grab a grab. Then this. Alright. Over here. Then we drop up this. Make sure you're not holding the button. You gotta. You can only hold the button once you act on the second press. When you uh, so then you can go as high as you possibly can. So it's a bit annoying. Some skeletons. This room has more skeletons. I didn't mean to pick that up actually. Supposed to pick up the one under it. Put that up. And then the three copies I make will just have to be these ones. This will activate the fan. There you go. Uh oh. There are many guys. And you're done. Skeleton. Hit this. I knew, I knew. Grab that, the key again. I push this? No. You win. Okay. A, a big key. Does that mean... I think I did the whole area. Oh, I have 999 again. Yikes. Oh, I didn't even find the dungeon map. Is the other side really the boss? I uh, didn't miss anything. I'm just forgetting. Oh, I'm sure I mentioned this before, but I'm no good with heights. Wait, hold on. I think I see something down there, huh? I guess that means I have to take a plunge after all.
It would be long fun to fight with a tape. Up and he died. <laughs> yeah, I got him. How far do we have to go? This goes on forever. Uh, there's no point in complaining about it. We must press onward. After all, how much more could there be? Come on, let's go. There could be a lot left, as there is a lot left. I wish I could burn those mummies with the fire. I'm trying to hold it the other time. So. The fact that I'm still a bit sloppy with the cape. It's a bit annoying, but it's fine. I feel like I miss something if I don't go up. Because I gotta go down here. And that gives me a key. And I'll need that key. For I don't remember when, but I don't need it. So first. Found out what that was. Was there a secret room in between those two? I actually don't remember. Maybe I should bond the wall. Why was that already on? I don't think I should go down there. Maybe I should. Just in case. It's like a fight room. A keenstone piece. Oh, okay. Well, I found out how to get to that side. Of the room, so let's go over here. Oh, okay. So it wasn't a bad thing. That's still there? No, it's not. Here's our map. I think I explored a good amount. 
three, four, and five don't have much. Uh oh. Stay away, please. Yep. Grab that keenstone and leave. I'll just get out. Don't want to fight in a room with fire. I mean, I can push those. Oh, those. That needs to be activated. So I have to blow the, the bomb wall um, or the almost broken boulders with my bow using that explosive energy. <clears throat> and once I blow up the wall, I'll be able to get through. I just I had to wait for him to go all the way around. What are you done for? There you go. Excuse me. Walk in here. Fire, fire. The teleport thing. I should just be. Yep. Thought so. I don't know if I can go over there. I can. Two hundred. Very nice. I'm not max ruby, so I guess grabbing anything else would be a waste. Oh, come on. I can put it. Yeah, this is the piece of heart we need. We a new heart container. Oh, and hey, look, I got all my hearts after losing them. Okay, grab the fall. Other than falling there, not a major setback, I don't think. No. I have to go down here. I mean, up. something out here. I don't know what's out here. Ah, uh, there's another bomb thing. Yeah, he's blocking it. Down here. I think there's something. Yeah, it's the, oh, it's the key. So once I get the key. Oh, goodness. Alright, here we are. Gotta be really careful. This is gonna be the hard one where I have to go, like, right in the middle. Oh, that was close. If you um hit it, it locks the door so you can't go through. 
So, pretty damn scary. Never mind. I, I guess I could have jumped over it, but that would have been a bit cheap. It was cheap. So now I can fall through. Go through here. Darn it. He can even do the walk, can he? Yes, he can. Break out of that. The fire. I guess it's because it's an ailment, maybe? You want it to last a while? Do you feel dumb? <laughs> Real question is Do I go over there or do I go this way? The boss and I wait, is there another boss key? So it must be over here. Cause I found a boss key but I unlocked but that was for like a mini boss. Good jump scare. Is this it? No, this is the Kingstone piece. Well, I have... It says I have the boss key. Does that mean I can use it on both doors? Am I allowed to do that? I honestly don't remember, but... Let me just heal up quick. You. Crashes. Didn't destroy him. I think that those this guy. Uh, any of that. Oh, so he does that now. Yeah, he's really good at being annoying. Be 
gonna probably loop until I kill him. And goes down. Not just the green ones. And he's dead. He's gonna crash. The Antaronk was like harder because his he didn't know what his move he's gonna do because all his attacks basically started off the same. That one was just he just had buddies to annoy you. Now we have the wind element. We get a nice heart container. And we get to leave. Now let's we have all four elements. Let's go revive the sacred blade. I guess we don't have to go down. We can just, you know, swing and fly out. There's still a lot we haven't really done in terms of side quests. <laughs> and now we have like everything, so. One important thing is to see the master of the blade. We have the cape. So now we can do a jump. And now we can do a, uh, a, like, down thrust attack. Let's try for yourself. Oh, my bad. Crap, wait, wait, wait. Yeah. There you go. Fine work. Get the tiger scroll. A down thrust. We still have a... I think we still have some, some uh, techniques to learn. We don't have to buy anything at the shop now. Uh, I guess I'll play it since we're here. We'll play a few nice uh, cool, cool games. Oh man, that's... The gold one is hard to get in. Um, mostly because if you can't hold him like the normal ones, He'll like, he resists you. He runs away. And the, uh. The white ones are just easy. You guys say we're too good to help others. Well, if I had no money, I guess. You know, I do. Oh. <laughs> we can also do some stuff around. Town. I guess we can see if anyone wants to trade King stones. Oh yeah, so this guy's too busy looking around. Uh, he's here, kind of hanging out. We can give him this. We also have a few more green King stones now. This King stone trade will make this guy be like. Hmm, I'm motivated. So now let's just build a whole house. Which is funny. So we just go in here, we leave, the house is being built, come back, leave, and the house is completely built. My goodness. Dang, I invite somebody to live here. I'm like, okay. There's, uh, there's people in the... Is this even count as a hotel? Anyway, we can just give any of these people the, the empty house. Um, I don't know. Yeah, and then he's just kind of walking around. I don't know what else to do. But now there's another person with the house, so that's cool. They have like charms. I don't, uh, I don't. I'm not sure what the charms do, but they have them. Let's see. What should we do next? Let me look. Uh, I almost forgot about this house. This house with the funny uh, monster on top. I said no thanks. Okay, here. So let me go here. 
All right, so this is a little battle thing. Ooh. After the, um, the fight, we, sh we should get, um, park container for fighting all these guys. And there you go, piece of heart. I accidentally called the heart container again. Hey, wake up. Say hi, do you enjoy it? Come back, and it's like, no, never again. Uh, now we... We're gonna go somewhere, I'll go to it. We're going to become tiny in, uh... The carpenter shop, and we're going to take the same route we took to get up the stairs as we did last time, and we're going to go into the sewers again. Once we enter the sewers, we can finally swim across, and <laughs> this is a casual heart piece. A heart piece just sitting right here. Uh, I think that's it, though, down here. Oh, there's this. It's 100 rubies in case you need it. I didn't, and I wasted it, but... You need it, it's right there. The next place. Let's quickly, uh, come back here and talk to Tingle. I guess... I guess you forgot to, uh, talk to him. I didn't talk to him. And we, um... We missed out on all of his brothers, so we're gonna go see them. As uh, fast as we can. Wanna go into this cave? Oh, I forgot about the three. Yeah, I need to be in front. I didn't think I, uh... Oh, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> oh, wow, I'm terrible. Use King Stones with... Uh, an ankle. <laughs> ankle. Yeah, he unlocks the next tree. Now let's go uh, find the others. So the next one's in Lake Hylia. Here is uh, David Jr. <laughs> That's his name, David Jr. A great uh, name that makes sense. He didn't like this one. Uh, I don't know where the last the last one is. Well, we'll find that. Actually, really quick. Oops, that's a bad jump. We need to jump over here. I missed it, but you can get that heart container. And then... Dig, go over here and dig into this cave. Once you dig through, you go all the way to the left side. And you'll find the mysterious wall for the Gorons. We'll clearly give that them to this and they'll be able to punch harder. At this exit... Going uh, further to the up and left, you'll get another uh, heart container, or piece of heart. Finally, in Tribute Highlands, we can find a our last single brother, and also another mysterious wall that we should quickly do. Up the ladder, you'll see the final brother we need, uh, Knuckle. Give him this, and then the final tree un will unlock. Next time, we'll continue to uh, find some secrets around and hopefully get some more hearts. See you next time. Goodbye.